All right, guys, so if you need to know how to pull these studs out, I'm going to show you a nifty little trick. It's really simple, really easy. Um, but right before I show you that little trick, uh, I want to tell you that there is a tool for that, in case you don't know. Most of you might know. So this little tool here that works kind of like the old Met wrench set, if you remember that. It grabbed the side of the nuts uh, or the bolt. This particular one has those little uh, circles in there that actually grip when you twist the opposite direction. So you put it in and just twist it like you're loosening it and it'll grab the sides of the uh, threads and pull it out. Um, also, I'll pull up a description uh, under the website if you remember backyardmechanic.org and uh, there'll be a link here if you want to buy one of these. I think I paid 27 or 28 dollars for this through Amazon. So I'll throw that on there if you want to check out backyardmechanic.org. I'll put a link on the, two, the YouTube channel here for that as well. So uh, I hope you enjoy this little video. You know it's about all, or excuse me, it's all about saving money. And uh, so here's the video, enjoy. Okay guys, so we're working on a Nissan Titan here. We got a cooling fan bracket assembly. We need to remove these studs and put them in this one. So I want to show you a quick, easy way without using a stud remover to pull these off. So all you're gonna do is grab a couple of the nuts that you took off of there and you're gonna roll one down Actually, you can put it on backwards. It might be easier if I can get it started with one hand. You're going to thread that down far enough to put a second one on it. That's probably good. Throw the second one on there, and then you're going to go grab two size, uh, two wrenches the same size. It looks like this is a 10 millimeter, and you're going to lock these together, tightening the top one to the to the right and the bottom one to the left, lock them together, and then you're gonna put the wrench on the outer one and thread your stud out. That way you can get the studs out and replace them and put them in this. So I hope this video helped you out. Click like, click subscribe, click on my name under the video for all my other how-to videos, and thanks a bunch, enjoy.